One of the big things that we spend a lot of time doing is shooting the actual elements of the car, the detail. It could be the quite aggressive air intake of an Aston Martin 177, a rear light cluster, the actual badged branding on the rear of the car, the grille in itself. It's part of the personality of the car. It defines really what that car is. When we look at shooting detail, the light really does come into its element. We shot recently a, a very nice deep red DB5, really gorgeous paint quality, and that's got to really come across. And what we did in the end was produce an image that it, it is a bit like a piece of art. We used a, a strip softbox, the 6x1, and we're using that directly against at a 90 degree angle to our position to shoot down on the bonnet. The power ratio on that was probably about 65-70%, so it's quite high on a single head. But by shooting that medium format, quite a high shutter speed, and really sort of taking the aperture down, what we effectively do is we funnel the light. We create a narrow stream of light. By nature, a softbox creates a soft light, and it disperses this light in a soft nature. If we bring the softbox into quite a close position, so it's quite close in its proximity to the area of the car that we want to shoot the detail, the properties of that light change. It's a more contrasted light, but it still maintains soft properties, which work well with, say, car detail and reflective surfaces. But it also reduces the fall off, so you, you've got a more channeled stream of light.